is up. There it is. My, my, my musty stroke. Listen to this here. <clears throat> A wanted, live-in housekeeper. Good home in exchange for the light duties. Apply in person to Arkwright's Superstores. Well, the woman coming to live here. What is Nurse Gladys going to say? Exactly. Eh? There you have her. Put your finger on it. Which is more than I've been able to do lately. <laughs> I'll tell you what Nurse Gladys is going to say. She's going to say, hey, up, I better marry him quick. He's getting a bit restless. And thus, with one masterstroke, I have brought my years of frustration uh, to an end. <laughs> hey, what's he doing advertising for living housekeepers? He'd drop dead if anyone applied. He's all wind and economy. What the bad for your heart to live in housekeepers? There was him up in Finkel Street. Died very sudden from a living housekeeper. <laughs> they seem to be much more overstimulating than legal wives. And I know what you die of. Acute constriction of the wallet. You might be surprised how quickly I would take to a suitable applicant. There will be a warm shopkeeper's welcome waiting for anyone who will walk through that door. <laughs> Except her. <laughs> Listen, go, go and serve the the the, the, lay, the old uh, the customer. Customer? Is he talking to me? <laughs> I'm not a customer. She's not a customer. <laughs> no, I'm not a customer. I just come in answer. We're clear. To we're clear. We're clear. We're clear. We're clear. We're shut. Shut? Shut, yes. What's he doing, shut? Don't, don't talk to him. He doesn't even work here. <laughs> we are shut. Uh, on account of the fe fe festival. Festival? Fe festival? The festival. The Saint, Saint uh, Cecil's. We always shut early on Saint uh, Cecil's. Who's Sir Cecil? No, not Sir Cecil. Just Sir Cecil. News to me. Yes, they shall shut early. <laughs> it's one of the biggest uh, shut early festivals in the whole of York. <laughs> Which one of you fellas is Arkwright? <laughs> well, it's not me. I'm his live out lady friend. Oh. Well, will you tell him I called in answer to a request from my friend Mrs. Dowdall, who is housebound on account of a terrible knee? <laughs> will you tell him Mrs. Dowdall only requires. Two small brown tomorrow, <laughs> not three. You're all right. Don't worry, I'll tell him, love. No, thank you very much. Oh. <laughs> <Sorry>. oh. <laughs> There's more staff than customers in this shop. 